Yo, what is going on, my YouTube peeps? Welcome back to another vlog. I know it's been some time. Uh, I was supposed to come out with a moving vlog, and I never completed that. I never even started it. It was just, it was just way too much work. I'm talking about from packing up the whole U-Haul truck to the straps on the tire of the Evo coming off constantly while we were driving all the way from New York down to Florida. It was just a sketchy ride and I'm just glad we made it safe and we are finally in Florida. So, you know, we took some time to adjust down here and so far so good. It's been, it's been going pretty good. So um, either way, today's vlog, we are going to go to another uh, ABKC registered event. It's, uh, it's called Bonanza based out of Kissimmee, Florida. So I'm looking forward to it. Uh, you know, Let's see what Florida is about. You know, let's let's uh, we're just going to go there to spectate, you know, and uh, we're going to go have fun and get some content. Unfortunately, I will not be bringing my with me due to the fact that it's just going to be me vlogging and um, just handling Zuki alone is um, it, it's, it's definitely work for sure. You know, so let me show you the dogs. So here goes the uh, here goes the Zookster. He's clearly excited because he knows we are going out and um i have a Maya over here she you can tell she's bummed out you know as much as i want to bring her is just having both of these dogs together is a lot of work and it's not mainly her she's actually really good this guy is a lot of work you know so he is sitting at about 100 pounds already so um i don't know if he's gonna do any more growing this is uh, his first time going to one of these events while he's, uh, you know, he's pretty much a, an adult now. He's uh, about a year and a half, I'm assuming. Um, I think in August he turns two years old already, which is crazy. Um, you know, I, ju I just remember not too long ago, you know, we, we just got this guy, you know. So it's, it's crazy how time flies, you know. So... No. Yeah, as you can see, he likes bothering his sister. So either way, I really appreciate everybody that has been subscribing to the channel. We are already at 4,500 subscribers, which is crazy. I started this channel at zero, remember that. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get uh, ourselves ready and we're gonna head out. Uh, this event is about an hour and a half drive from where we're at. So, um, you know, which isn't too bad, but um, enjoy the content. Please don't forget to uh, hit that notification bell that lets you know exactly when I'm posting up another vlog. Don't forget to subscribe. Show the video some love. It's free. Just give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate everybody's support and enjoy the vlog. into here this guy he can sense dogs he's getting very excited over here so um, looks like it's a pretty packed parking lot so far I know you guys can't see but uh, yeah we're gonna head up in here and uh, we'll see how this uh, Bonanza goes that's what it's called it's called uh, registered by the ABKC uh, Bonanza Okay, so, 
the 20 dogs and, and adult 20. All right. Add a 40. Yep. You're welcome. Sounds good, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Let's go. Uh, let's go take a lap around and see what see what we got going on over here. There's definitely a lot of people and a lot of dogs. So far it's been a pretty cool event. Um, it's not as big as I thought it would be, but uh, there's a lot of cool people here. Everybody's mad friendly. As you can see, uh, some dogs were 
pretty much barking, but everything's pretty chill over here, so can't complain. That about wraps up our day in Kissimmee, Florida at uh, Bonanza 2021. It was actually pretty decent, you know. Um, I would say it was a little bit more people than dogs, but um, it was, you know, still a dope event. A lot of chill people, you know. Um, everyone was super cool. It was a lot of beautiful dogs. Uh, I saw, I would say, a good 80% of dogs here were all pocket bullies, you know. So. Um, you can tell pocket bullies is the big thing here in florida uh they're beautiful dogs either way you know uh there was a few extra large bullies um including zuki and there was also these uh two extra extra large bullies that uh i was trying to get footage of but everyone was just trying to take pictures of them you know so i tried my best um either way uh we're gonna wrap this vlog up and i'm not sure if we're gonna wrap the vlog up entirely only because I do have uh, something from, I think it's called, the company called Bully Max. It's actually a toy that comes with a handle. And I kind of want to do like a mini review on it and see uh, see how he likes it. Um, you guys already know, whoever watched my previous vlog, I did the uh, review on the tether pole. Um, it wasn't really a review, but um, I have yet to install it in the backyard. So either way, he's tired. Um, I'm hungry. I have not eaten anything. So... I'm going to go ahead and uh, get going. Uh, much love to everyone that has been show showing support. Uh, don't forget to drop a like on the video. It helps a long way. Um, it's free. You know, it's free to show love. Um, but yeah, we're going to wrap this up and peace. All right. So I'm going to open this up real quick and let's see exactly. Okay. Yeah. So it's from the company called Bully Max. Um, they are not paying me. They are not sponsoring me. Again, we buy this with our own money. So this this seems pretty durable. It looks very durable. You almost you almost hit me in my crotch. Uh, let's see here. So far, what I've seen from the reviews is that they're bullies or pit bulls, because we have both. You know, we, Maya is a, a she's a uh, considered a uh, American Staffordshire. I don't know if I'm saying that right. What is it? Staffordshire. Staffordshire. I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments. But uh, she's considered a red nose, and this guy is a bully. So when I first uh, started vlogging with these dogs, I didn't know the difference between a bully and a pit bull, and everybody was basically hounding me on, you know, on the comments. But this actually seems very durable. The only thing is that we got to see it has air in it. I don't know how long this is going to last because this guy right here, especially her, she definitely destroys toys, you know. So, But, yeah, we're going to go to our local park, you know, so that we can... Um, get some footage and then uh you know we're, we're gonna let you know how this is see if we like it or not hopefully they don't destroy it uh have a feeling they, they're going to you know and then uh we're gonna wrap this vlog up and i'm hoping you guys enjoy um all of the vlog i'm gonna show you guys what we like to bring especially when we go out to the park so we like to bring them some water and we like to make sure we have our poopy bags because we are responsible dog owners a lot of times the reason why dogs are not allowed into parks is because there's a lot of people that don't pick up after their dogs poop so it is what it is um and then we got their little bowls for them so so yeah we're gonna get going we're gonna go to the park get this uh little review going on here this seems really cool it seems very durable i ha i don't know so there's something something here tells me this thing is just gonna rip apart so this guy here is being very extra you know so you like that Hmm? Yeah? He's like, oh yeah. Yeah? Yeah? <laughs> He's super loud, by the way. This guy, he... That's all, he's ser serious, he's super loud. So if you got, if you have a bully, expect the loudness from them. They're just very loud dogs. You know, Maya's very quiet. She's not as loud as this guy here. And, uh, but yeah, she looks very... Maya's like, yo, can we just leave, you know? All right, we're going to wait until we go to the park, dude. All right, so, All right. so we finally made it here. Uh, this is called Gemini Springs. It's actually a beautiful area. Um, these guys are very impatient. There's other dogs here. Now, the only reason why I don't like letting these dogs loose with other dogs is because they want to go say hi. They don't want to fight. They want to go say hi, but they look intimidating to everybody else besides us and the bully community because we understand these dogs a lot better. And uh, basically, um, when other people see these dogs, they get freaked out, you know, so... 
Um, at the at the you know at the end of the day, we still want to be responsible. So we're gonna take them out here. Hopefully, we don't run into any other dogs because we're gonna let them loose out here. So um, here's hoping that this goes smooth. So we're gonna you know go ahead and play with this toy. Let's see how they like it and take it from there. He definitely loves it, he loves the toy, but I just don't know how long this is gonna last. See, right now he's not even grabbing it. <laughs> Holy smokes. Here right now he's not even grabbing it from the toy, he's grabbing it from the, from the stupid. Let it go, let it go. Good boy. Maya, Maya! Hey, Maya! Maya, get over here! You guys, you guys just heard me screaming at the top of the lungs. They got freaked out over there. So, this is the only problem you have with these dogs is the stigma that they have. Even if they're well trained, people are always going to judge you for having these dogs. So, um, enjoy them. Enjoy them. If you don't have tough skin, you should not be owning these dogs at all. All right, because people are going to judge you. You know, people are going to judge you just like they judge these dogs. Get, get. He likes to bite this string. I'm not a big fan of this toy because uh, what this guy is doing is he he wants to pull, but being that this is a uh, this is not that uh, I don't I don't know. It looks like it's air filled, and because of it, he can't get a good grip of it, and he wants to tug. As you can see, he's tugging. So this is definitely not the best toy, unfortunately. Yeah, he's pretty much done with it. It's not a bad toy. Um, I personally think that uh, they should have a regular uh, regular uh, string instead of uh, this bungee cord here, because this will definitely snap. This guy is very heavy, he's 100 pounds, and when he uses all his weight, he uses all that weight. He'll definitely strap. If you're not paying attention, he will definitely drag you, without a doubt. He'll, he'll knock you down to the floor. Either way, um, pretty cool toy. I don't think it's, uh, you know, it's not considered a durable toy. This is a toy that you can definitely use to, um, you know, to just tug. Not a bad investment, you know. If you, if you want to get some exercise for your dogs, you can definitely use this. And um, we're actually going to go ahead to Starbucks real quick. The only reason why is because I'm going to give these guys a puppuccino. So if you guys have never done that, we're going to show you how to do it. I don't know if they're doing it here in Florida. I do know in New York. Uh, every time we ask for a puppuccino, they literally, it's, it's pretty much whipped cream in a cup. That's pretty much what they give you. So we're going to go see if we can get some, you know, go get something to drink because I'm kind of thirsty. It's a little hot outside. So um, shout out to my East Coast people. And you, guys, you guys are getting hit with a snowstorm today. So I do not miss that snow at all. So I'm very happy that we're here in beautiful weather. Um, I know that one of my subscribers did say that uh, this gives me more of a reason to vlog even more. I wish that was the case, you know, so this is why I want to make sure I give you guys uh, a lengthy vlog so you guys can actually watch and enjoy, you know, because it would suck for me to pump out five, 10 minute vlogs, which would be a lot easier for me, not fair for you guys, you know. So either way, we're going to wrap this up. We're going to go uh, to Starbucks real quick and we're going to show you what it is to order a puppuccino for these guys. Um, oh, by the way, by the way, let me show you real quick. I actually got some dog treats at Bonanza. I'm going to show you real fast. Um, I'm not too sure what the company's called. Here we go. Sweets Pet Treats. So this is their Facebook and their Instagram. It's Sweets Pet Treats. They were actually super cool. It's funny because that's, that's the guy I spoke to. He was super friendly. I think he was there with his wife. Super friendly people, and they basically have real um, healthy um, snacks. Like they have, we um, that day I got dehydrated chicken. What else? We also got dehydrated beef. You know, so 
it was kind of embarrassing because they gave us free tr free treats that day and Zuki did not want no part of it. He just I, I guess maybe his mind was focused on other things, but let me see if uh let me see if we could give him some treats. I'm gonna give him the dehyd dehydrated beef. I know there's dogs around there. I'm gonna let them go real quick. Oh, there he's he's done. He's done. He's like, yeah, I'm done. So this is why we like to put the weighted vest on him because um, you know it wears him out a lot quicker. You know, it's it's very good to distribute that energy because these these dogs here have high energy. So and you guys ever wonder why they poop, pee, and tear stuff in your house? It's because you don't work them out. Either way, Man, it actually smells really good. Smell that. Oh wow! Yeah. That smells really good. Okay. All right. See, I got them. I got their attention. So, sit. Sit. Okay. All right, wrong one. There we go. He found the right one. There we go. So it looks like uh, these treats are actually a hit. So uh, check them out. They're on Instagram. They're called Sweets Pet Treats. So shout out to them. They gave me samples before I bought stuff for them. So um, shout out to them. They were very cool people. Again, Bonanza was super dope. I, you know, I, I enjoyed my time out there. There was a lot more bullies, uh, standard bullies and pocket bullies than anything else. Though. So it looks like that's the biggest thing here in Florida. Uh, they're all beautiful dogs either way. So uh, either way, we're going to head to Starbucks real quick and uh, we're going to wrap this vlog up. Looks like there's other dogs waiting to get their puppuccinos. <laughs> He's looking right at us too. It's mad funny. Oh, we get those first. There we go. Thank you. So this is what the. Have a great day. Thank, Thank you, you too. Oh, no. Thank you. No, it's okay. I got it. Thank you. So this is what the puppuccino looks like right here. It's 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 literally just a cup with whipped cream in it that's all i think it's whipped cream all right so we're gonna start off with both of them here the omaya and the zuki this is why i like starbucks because they cater to your dogs and this was free so yeah again these are called puppuccinos you can get them for free you know um i wouldn't recommend to be a douche about it and go just go there just for puppuccinos Social support, you know, buy something there, and uh, that's what we do. Thank you, mamas. She cleaned up my <laughs> car. <laughs> and just like that, they are all done. They made a mess, but as you can see, they're all done here. So, either way, guys, thank you for tuning in for uh, this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so. Please give the video a like. It's free to show love, and it helps our channel out a lot. Uh, the more likes we get, the more we can actually cre keep on creating more content, you know, so um, And I'm hoping that the uh, vlog was long enough for you guys. I didn't want to just put up a 14 minute vlog. So but uh, Till the next time much love guys. Peace